Three coming with a review here. Uh, as y'all know, I might be posting this in, uh, in this video before or after the last vid, so go check out whichever vid first uh, that pops out. Um, this might be after the next vid. Um, but yeah, ended up picking up these bad boys. A lucky pickup. Lucky surprise pickup, I say, because I was surprised to even see they were there. I mean, it was a canceled layaway. Somebody, I guess, put the layaway and then hit it back there. And let's just say they canceled it and I left with them. Uh, well, a lot of the, the, the shoe stores around my area changed management. Uh, it's crazy. I knew a couple of them. And, well, that business is crazy. Uh, I would like to get into it, but... It's nuts. Um, but yeah. So I ended up getting lucky with these bad boys. I did get in retail. They're not I'm not getting them like I didn't pay over retail or anything for them. Um I will tell you how this uh having them on hand, uh they are very dope. I don't see well at least with my pair that I have, uh don't see it's not completely flawless, but it's almost there. Um there is a couple spots where you can see the glue kind of pop out some. Like right there in the toe box. I don't know if y'all can tell it's kind of shinier. Right there in the corner. Uh, but that's really it. And then everything else looks good to me. Uh, but yeah, I got lucky with these. Uh, I'll say the story again because it was pretty easy. They, uh, a couple weeks ago, I went to uh, the mall. saw that the pre-grapes. Uh, one store still had the pre-grapes. It was crazy. Like out of nowhere... They all started selling out, or I guess they returned them to Nike or Jordan brand, whoever they returned them back to. Um, and I saw that there was one pair left at a Champs, and I was like, yo, let me go back. And I'm like, oh, and I saw some creases, but you got to remember some of these fives and some of these leathers came out pre-creased already, so... I was like, yo, you know me, I'm going to try to hustle them down. Let me see if I can get like 20% off. Because at that time, I could, I could uh, probably could have afforded, you know, getting those or putting them in, in layaway. Because that's the thing that's awesome about Champs. Don't forget, guys, if you want a sneaker two weeks after the release or whenever they released, you can always put them in layaway at, uh, at uh, House of Hoops, Foot Locker, Champs, and Foot Action. Uh, that's the one thing I love about the, that story. Other than that, some of them just have some bullshit uh, customer service. But I will say this, the champs that, this champs that I got it at, their customer service has bumped up uh, since a while. Um, I didn't know the store manager, but she was pretty cool. Uh, but the other one was just lazy and they didn't even say hi or anything. But this time now, they say hi even if they're like, across the whole entire store but um anyways back to the suit so uh i went to go look at them they were they weren't there no more i went the next day well that weekend uh the weekend after i went and they weren't there and i was like dang why are these selling i don't know i guess they sold um and then i'm like uh she asked me so blah blah can i help you and i was like no i was wondering how what happened to those fives y'all had that were sitting there? They were like, oh, I think we sold them. I think they sold like two days ago. And I was like, are you kidding me? And then I was like, oh, uh, let me try on these up temples because I've been wanting up temples. They were, the temples, the, the Sacramento temples, they were like $69 at finish line or something like that that weekend. So I was like, oh, let me try them because then they had a 14 online. I mean, a 13, and I was like, yo, let me see if the 13 fit. The 13 fit me way too perfect, and I don't like it too perfect. I want it a little bit tiny bit loose, um, but they they didn't fit well. And then she was like, do you like 10s? And I was like, oh, it depends. I, I'm not too big, too fond of them. I only like the original colorways, and one of the, the, the Chicago colorway, and uh, the... The all red ones that came out, the bad apples, I don't know what they were called, the big big apple, whatever they're called. I uh, like the Sacramento ones, uh, I like the DBs and the shadows, and then the white and red ones. So that is a couple of them, but there's like tons of tens out there. 
Um, but I ended up, uh, well, she ended up coming out. And she was like, well, let me go see what, uh, I know they're white, but I don't know what it is. And I'm like, what is, which ones that are white that came out? And I was like, yo, are these the, are those the double nickels? Nah, it's part of the Toros, but hey, you know, let me see them. And she brought him out, and it was a double nickels. And that's, I was like, yo, I called the wifey. Babe, I need to get these, put these on A-Way or something, because I need these in my collection. Um, and all I need, basically, is a 9, and I will have 1 through 11. If I get a 12, when I get the 12 next year, I'll have 1 through 13, and I'll be good. Um... Because there's not that many 12s I like. There's not that many 10s I like. Not that many 9s. And not that many 14s. And not that many 15s. And I think that's all I go to. I don't really like anything out there. Um, the only ones that I like are the 17s and the 18s. And that's really it. And I only like like one or two colorways out of each also. So, yeah. So, I ended up copying these. And I'm going to tell you, these are very dope. So, let's get into a quick review on these. Obviously, the big obvious thing y'all can see there, um, it is a tumble, a tumble leather upper with a little bit of a smooth leather here. Now, I will tell y'all there's a smooth leather, it's or synthetic smooth leather, whatever. Uh, right here, it's not that good. Uh, I will tell y'all this on my uh, Pro Star pairs, they're better. <clears throat> um, but this tumble leather is a little bit almost like the seven the flint sevens the flint sevens are feel a little softer or well, at least the white leather the black leather up here is very soft it's not as soft as the oreos because i think the oreos were like the best quality this year out of the tumble leathers uh smooth leathers i only seen a couple and i'll be honest with you sorry to say but yeah so we have tumbled black tumble leather white tumble leather and then this uh synthetic smooth leather right here and then the and then the 45 right here stitched in we have a uh, black tumble leather tongue black in the back with that red inner and it has that little special thing the tens have um don't remember what it says but we're gonna have whoo there goes the lighting uh, just says Air Jordan Collection, <laughs> Jordan logo on the back, and y'all yeah, know all of his accomplishment, uh, accomplishments, Black Mitzo, it's just a Chicago, it's a Chicago 10, just with a 45 on it, but these were the ones he first came in with, because nobody knew, this first game back, yeah, I think if I'm not wrong, he wore these, so, yeah, Nothing much more to say about these. They're, they're, they're really dope. Uh, to me, they're like the cleanest color other than the shadows. Uh, I will, you know, one day I'll probably get those other ones. But the ones I'm really, really looking forward to ever getting is those Sacramento 10s. Those Sacramento 10s are the ones that got me a little bit more into 10s. But yeah, so as y'all can see, they're still DS. Small delicious. Uh... If I had a chance to get them, I know these didn't release. I think these released back in February or January or March, around the beginning of the year. And I got lucky I'm in the middle of the year with these. So I'm happy with them. So nothing much more to say, guys. So, yeah, go check out the past, the last vid with all the pickups. I picked up a couple Funkos, uh, a shirt for the wifey, and these. And went to go see Straight Outta Compton. I'm going to repeat it. Super dope movie. Uh, go watch it. I'm telling you, go watch it. It's worth the money. Uh, we had trouble trying to even look for tickets. They were sold out everywhere. Um, my wife is over here messing around with the bag. Um, uh, yeah, man. Super dope movie. We got lucky. Well, it's not that we got lucky. It was one of the movie theaters. It was like... Second most expensive one, but it was like same as a cheap one, you know, you know, and I was like forget about it We're gonna pay the two extra dollars. Oh, wow uh, You know, it's worth it was worth it. I was gonna be mad if it wasn't worth it I was like yo, I'm not can't see my my baby's face if this movie wasn't worth it, but it was more than worth it 
But yeah, so that's it. That's all I did. Uh, more pick of it's not sure. Uh, it'll probably be a while. The only next shoe I really want, that I really, really want, is the Anthracite 9s, the Playoff, I mean, the Aqua 8s, and the Chrome 8s. Uh, but that's really it, Jordan wise, at least. I do want those Pippins, man. Them, them Chicago Pippins. They're bringing them back uh, this year and next year. I said, but my goal next year, my first sneaker I'm picking up next year is them up temples, them more up temples. They're finally bringing them back out, and I'm getting them. I've been, you can ask my wife every time I say, I'm getting them, I'm getting them. And I always luck out. Um, but yeah, I mean, I don't luck out, but yeah. So this is Hunter Mr. 83. I'll check out my other vids, my pickle vids. I uh, might do a vlog, I'm not sure. Still trying in the transition of moving. Uh, but yeah, go check out my Instagram, Twitter, same as here. Hunter Mr. 83. God bless. See y'all later. Bye.